So, hey guys, it's Josh, aka Dr. X, aka Falcon Executive, and I apologize for any annoying background noises, my PCs rendering one of my newer videos, which you guys will see it soon. So, I wanted to introduce to you guys, if you like this, leave a like and a comment if you think it's nice, um, something called story time, in which I will, this will, I will try to do every week. Um, and it's basically just about one thing it's about stories of the past of my cultic hero's life well it's just really about stories that happened to me things that happened to me and i want to like share with you guys which are really really interesting i think and some things you guys will never ever have thought about would i would ever really do so if you guys know what i mean it's stuff that you would not ex uh, expect from somebody like me and it's nothing about scamming really because i never really did that so I don't have any experience with that either, but it's about something else which was also illegal and still is at that time. And today's story time, which is going to be the first episode, is about me buying an account. Yep, I did that. I bought an account. It was not executive, it was not my old domains, it was something on Ross Matter at that time. And I'm not going to say the name because I do not want to like get that person banned still, so it doesn't matter. Anyways, so that person <laughs> at that time... Um, I later gave the account back to the owner just saying but I bought it for like 50 bucks. Well I know it's kind of illegal but really there's no name to that so it doesn't matter right now. Anyways so I bought this account for 50 bucks and how it, it was quite funny I thought it was a scam in the first point so I did not want to buy it I was like dude fuck off. And that person at that time was known to be like most likely a scammer like he wasn't are taken seriously by anyone because he did scam before and that was why he wanted to sell your account it was a level a high level rogue like a really high level rogue at that time um, it was something it was times when I speak of high level 190 that means that previous previously before the new engine came so pre new engine that was those times and it was it was really it was fun at that times and uh, because I did not have DL on my main at that time, and that guy had DL, I was so interested and it was a rogue. He even had the fucking main hand, he didn't have the off hand because, you know, he got kicked from his clan, I think, because he just scammed people. And uh, shit, but I wanted to have the account anyways to farm and stuff. And so he met me at the beach when I was like level 3, and he was like, hey man, you're from a different server, right? I was like, no, just start the game, basically. And um, he was like, okay, this is an alt. I was like, yep, this is an alt. And... He was like, oh, hi, who's your main? I told him who my main was. And he was like, all right, I know you, man. I killed you in the arena before. I was like, yeah, no, man. I was like, he's really sorry for this. Now he uh, wants to sell his account because he has real life problems with his girlfriend. <laughs> that was like his his thing. Like, uh, he did that to scam people. And I was like, dude, you're going to pull scam on me, right? He was like, no, real not. And I was like, all right, how much is selling the account for? It was like 100 bucks. I was like, 100 bucks is too much for an for account in a game. He was like, okay, 70, I was like, 50. He was like, okay, you wanna see what's on the account? I was like, yeah, sure. And actually, I did something which you guys would call bitch, bitching, but I was, <laughs> I did put, just to try, I put my mail on this and it worked. He did not have any mail registered. So my fuck, I got my fucking mail on this before I even bought it. And that was the thing, I was like, all right, this guy is stupid as fuck. And I was like, uh, I told him like, okay, I'm gonna take it because the account was a lot of shit, really. He had three divine brooms, three, which is which was and still is, I think, pretty rare. And um, he also had those old snowman hats and stuff on this, so it was kind of cool. I just went ahead and bought the account, and not via PayPal because I didn't know that existed at that time. Um, it was something other. I used my personal bank account and sent that money to America to get um, the account, and that was hap that was what happened. So and he was like, one day later, he was like, all right, I got the money. And uh, he was like, you can change the password now. And I did that and I owned the fucking account. And like three or four days I played in that account and people always kept uh, causing me out for uh, being a scammer, for being a douche, um, for killing in the arena and being a traitor to the clan, keeping clan items and shit. So it was kind of, it was kind of fun uh, because I was like, it's, it's some bullshit. I mean, no one knew it was me. Okay. Uh, it wasn't the real one, I mean. So no one knew it was me on this account. That was that was a thing which was uh, really, really amusing as fuck. And I enjoyed that. And then suddenly a level, it was I think it was 100, 110, 120, uh, with full ready and ESPM, it was like, hey dude, and are you enjoying the account? 
I thought it was someone who wanted to try testing, but he was like, he, he said his name and um, his, his bank address basically, um, which you need in order to like get the payment going. That's what I did. I was like, all right, it's, it's the guy. I was like, um, yeah, it's cool, it's cool, I really enjoy it, but people keep on uh, cussing me out. And he was like, uh, that's common, bro, just ignore it, you can join any clan still. And um, it, was, it, was, it was really funny. It was, it was so fun to me to just run on this account and kill people in the arena, so that's what I did 24-7. And um, I dual logged with my real main and this account, and I always told people it wasn't me, and it was kind of funny. And... Uh, <laughs> At that time, I really had one of the best times in Kelly Heroes I always had, and I was just like, because Arena was real life there, it was um, not real life, but it was real, like, alive, that's what I mean to say, it was enjoyable as fuck, alright, it was addicting as fuck, just killing people, idling, potting, all that shit, you know, it's, it was a fucking Arena, it was funny as fuck, and um, that's what I really like. I think you couldn't even use pots back then, but idols, pretty sure you know, we used idols in that. But those times are long gone, and um, well, actually, I have some screenshots of all this shit happening on my older um, um, SD card. Like, if I get an SD card reader, I will do a giant video about executive in the past, and you know what I mean. So, um, it's gonna be fun for you to watch and just enjoy. But yeah, it was really like it was one of the best times to having Celtic Heroes, and then like it wasn't wasn't even a week later i was like dude um the account is cool but it sucks just always people being mad at me he, he was like he was really sad on his radiant ears broke he was like oh i'm gonna get frozen again and frozen at that time was fucking difficult to get if you were not in any clan that uh, was able to kill the bosses and that happened to the guy he wasn't in any clan that was able to kill the boss so frozen was almost impossible for him and it really sucks i mean i know it i know the feeding bro i still do and it was really, it was such a pain. And then he was like, he's gonna give me like 70 bucks if I resell him the account. I was like, 70 bucks, um, isn't that a little bit too much? He was like 50, I was like, all right. So we kind of trade everything back. And that's what happened. He never refunded the money, he just gave me, all right, sorry, my record just crashed, but yeah, he uh, never really refunded the money from uh, my account. He just gave me the money back. And so he never really did take it back. He could have just went to his bank and said that the money was uh, sent to the wrong person and he wanted to take it back, but he didn't do that. Um, I appreciate this, so he didn't scam me at all. Uh, and he got his account back and I kept his Radiant um, Earthstone Breastplate and we kind of became friends that way, so he stopped killing me in the arena and shit. And he was just on his account killing shit again. I think he got banned later on, like a year later, but that was when I uh, left Frost Matter actually to a Raven. So um, that was that was kind of one of the best times I really had in Celtic Heroes, you know. And uh, it's it's so fucking amusing. Just when I when I think back, like all that shit we did in the arena, and um, because I did not have any character over 150 at that time. It was kind of hard, but uh, he was like, I could use his Mord Spear um, if I if I ever hit 108. He was like, he's gonna give it to me, the Helm too. I could just have fun with that. And we really turned out to be great friends, which is fucking awesome at that time. And I did not have any uh, real, like, good high-level friends that time because I thought I was a noob. And um, that was, like, the only guy that was, like, one of my connections, which led on to a few things later on, which was really cool. Just, just was a very big advantage for me just to know this guy because he also knew some people and it was kind of cool like the whole thing like people forgave him for his shit like he turned mythology later on um no one really did care about his past which is kind of kind of it was always fun to me but it was like at that time where everyone sold their accounts um levi classic i don't know uh, how fast x are you and stuff all those people's names i still remember from what's matter um most people also sold their accounts and um, a lot of people said they did, and I don't know if that ever happened, but some it sometimes seemed as this wasn't the same dickhead on that account anymore, because those people were most likely uh, dickheads, except for how X, uh, he was kind of always correct, but I think it's Levi on this account right now, I don't know, it doesn't matter, this does not matter at all, um, I don't want to do any assumptions on here, but, um, well, that kind of led to some, some things happening on what's matter, which was kind of fun, and that was just how the story ends when I ran, ran off basically from this matter to a raven because I thought um, I had more chances in there um, to get in the top clan because I actually knew people and I get got into the top clan actually but that's another story. So see you guys in the next video as always have a nice week. <laughs>
love